December 27th and we are starting off my new series life as a mom in grad school life as a single mom in grad school with two children so it's currently like eight something in the morning i'm filming youtube videos i'm taking um my dip powder nails off and i'm going to show people how i put them back on hopefully while remaining in the focus of a camera um i have a little setup um, on my floor because i like to sit on the floor um basically where i do my filming um and I this is how I do my nails off camera anyway, so it makes more sense to just do it where I normally would do my nails. So um I wanted to start this off as like an intro since I'm waiting on one hand to um get the stuff off because I do one hand at a time. So I wanted to give you guys a little bit of insight or background into me before we go into this whole series thing um so i've been doing youtube videos on and off since 2010 so nine years it was nine years like in august um on and off since was it was in 2010 or was it two no i take that back i think since 2009 um, so it's been 10 years. <laughs> it's hard to remember, um, because I've taken so many high hiatuses and I have two channels. So I have a hair channel, hair beauty <clears throat> channel, and then I have this channel, Gorgeous Creations, which I just started, um, at the beginning of 2019. And, um, this channel has evolved a lot over such a short amount of time, but, um, I feel like Gorgeous Creation speaks to more than just crafting. It also speaks to me and who I am because I'm all, I feel like we all are creations um, that we're constantly changing, molding to become better people. So at first I wasn't going to film about this, but I feel like I need to because grad school is weighing me down. Um, and I feel like talking about it will maybe help other people with their experiences or at least, you know, give me a little bit more insight into things that I can do. I can kind of change, you know, just for my peace of mind. So um, I go to Western Governors University, which is an online based school. Um, it is accredited in, in all 50 states, which means it's hard as hell. And I said, oops, oops, shoot, 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 shoot. Hold on, you guys. <clears throat> and I to adjust my angles. Um, I say it's hard as hell because it is. Uh, it basically, um, you have, you know, your performance-based um, things and then your assessment type things. In grad school, it's all, most all performance-based. Um, in undergrad, it was a mixture of performance-based and assessments. Um, so it's performance, or it was a mixture. So I started going to WGU in January of 2013 yeah um or was it 2012 i think it was i think it was 2013 i think i felt like it took me six years to finish 2013 um and i had struggles like all along the way but that's the topic for another day anyway i decided to go back so i graduated in january of 2019 with my bachelor's in interdisciplinary studies, which basically is um, K through, well, they call it something else, but um, I, it's, I forgot what it's called um, because I ended up not doing the uh, student teaching, 
which changed the name of my bachelor's but um it was interdisciplinary studies from k to t k to eight um and then i went back recently in august to get my master's in research and curriculum research and, yeah research and curriculum instruction or something like that so i've only done one class because hell life life has hit me hard like this past couple weeks i've been well not weeks like month and a half i've just been in like some sort of out of body depressed state um it's hard to really describe it's hard to really say like what it really is but um i want to get back to doing schoolwork so today is the day um today is the day um i have passed one class i am currently in my second class I need to write three papers for it. One is on behavior, behavioralism. One is on constructivism. I don't know. You'll see because I'll put it in later. Um, but I have to write three papers. So I'm off of work for five days. I have today off thursday which is thanksgiving the day after and then saturday and sunday like normal so my plan is to get some youtube stuff which i like some youtube stuff done some homework stuff done and kind of alternate back and forth which means that i'm probably not going to be sleeping last night i spent most of my time doing youtube videos editing youtube videos i was falling asleep waking up falling asleep waking up doing editing videos i didn't really start sleeping until two when i was up at like 7 45 so here i am taking my nails off because this is a little bit more tedious type thing so i wanted to record it for youtube but it, i know it's tedious so this also gives me an opportunity to do it when my son is asleep um i haven't had any coffee yet i haven't had any water yet i need to have both Preferably water first because I've been really slacking on my eating right stuff. Um, but I kind of want to give you guys an intro into me. If you guys have questions about the school that I attend, then just leave them down below. I can do like a Q&A for that because it's a lot. <laughs> um western governors is like it's a lot to go to school online and solely be like dependent on your own to do your own educate like your own educating like there is online but you are responsible for getting your classes done you are the one who is doing all the teaching in a sense you are learning by reading and research and all that stuff and then you're in you're um implementing it in different ways and they want to see like verify that you you know how to do it so it's very difficult because there are a lot of times like me where i don't have oh a set deadline so i can fall off track um yeah <laughs> and that tends to happen more than i like to admit um so this is me picking myself back up by the bootstraps and being like look we got to get this done because, hey, who else going to take care of these kids? And there's a reason why you went back. I went back to further my education, but also to build myself up in the educational field because I don't want to be a daycare teacher forever. Like, I just don't. Um, so, yeah. We'll start that. We'll start this off here. And then we'll go on about the rest of our day. <laughs> So, it is currently 3.40. Let me tell you what I've done for school so far today. I'm literally about to go open my stuff and do it now. Um, yeah, but my son wants me to be in the living room with him. And my phone charger is in here. Here, my phone needs to be on the charger because it's low, 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 low. Um, YouTube life, I have gotten through <sighs> a 
making a video. I did my nails, which brings me such joy. Like, they're so pretty. They came out so great. And I'm absolutely amazed with these. That was the one. I filmed that video. Um, I still have a couple more videos I need to film. Like, I need to film um, me making this hat. But I think I may hold that off until like Friday or Saturday. Um, it's supposed to be done by the weekend, so it has to get done. It's what it is, because I promise that will be done by the weekend. So I'm going to do that. Um, and I could start on that now. But with my phone being in here, my phone has the address. And then I have to plug up my computer. But I want to get some school work in. So I'm going to do school work now. And then do YouTube stuff. But I like legit. Let me tell you. So since you guys saw me at what? 8? I don't know. Whatever time it was this morning. Um, I did my nails. Which took longer. Because I was on a YouTube video. So it took longer. The process of moving cards. Battery dying. Yes honey. I'm coming, I'm coming, I promise. Wait, now? Give me like five seconds, okay? I want, I want to do that. I'm coming. I'm coming. About four. Okay. Um, but yeah, like, I started doing that. Son woke up when I was taking, still taking polish off. So I was making a video with him up him behind me thankfully it's just gonna be a voiceover video so that's fine um then i was making thumbnails putting in information for two videos i uploaded but they didn't have thumbnails they didn't have any information in. they didn't have any tags so i did all that today um i published a video today I still have a couple more videos I need to edit that are in queue, <laughs> which basically means they're on my um, external hard drive. Then um, I did some, you know, social media posts or whatever. Um, I need to revamp my social media, my um covers for my gorgeous creations my facebook pages i need to revamp those so i really really need to make a list of things i need to do so i really need to pull out my notebook for that um gosh i feel like i got you know when you feel like you have so much on your plate like it's so much that you want to do and you're trying to figure out how to do it all within a certain amount of time that's me um i'm drinking coffee i know i told you guys about water and coffee earlier today I had water. I had 30 ounces of water, so we're doing good with water so far. Um, I'm about to drink another, some more water. I put it in the freezer, but I forgot about it. So it's like really cold, and I don't really like my car, my water like super cold. It has ice in it. Um, but I'm gonna drink it because I want to eat the ice. <laughs> I'm addicted to ice, y'all. Don't tell nobody. Um, but. I'm just now drinking my coffee, so uh, it's almost gone. Um, what's in here is, oops, sorry, I don't think we can get a good angle. What's in here is coffee, heavy whipping cream, and then Skinny Jordan's um, caramel pecan syrup and their salted mocha, mocha carob. Ooh. Salted mocha caramel syrup. Um, so yeah, I just stopped to drink this because I started getting sleepy. So this will give me another little boost. I'm gonna eat something I think, and I'm it's in my handy dandy WGU cup liquid motivation. Uh, <laughs> so I'm gonna get the charger from my computer. And then I'm going to go back up front and I am going to do some schoolwork while I sit next to my son. Oh, and then I played on Roblox with my son for about an hour while I tried to do work 
and some it was it was a bit much but it was one of those things that he kind of needed and I think I kind of needed too which is why he wants me to be next to him he just wants to spend time with his mama all the time that he can get with his mama and I you know sometimes it gets annoying and not necessarily annoying it's just because it's like he doesn't have anybody else to bounce to because it's always mommy like mommy's always here so yeah so I think I'm gonna do some school work for like maybe an hour and a half two hours and I'm gonna get him something to eat first before so I can sit down and do what I need to do but I think I'm gonna do school work for like two hours and then that will probably lead me around this time to almost time to cook dinner which will mean back to YouTube life um, I don't know if I'm gonna film or I don't know but I'll come back in at some point because my phone will be charged I'm just gonna leave it on charger in here um, since I have a Mac when I plug it up in my room it's on the same frequency or whatever I get messages and everything on my computer so I don't need to have my phone uh, so yeah I'll be back in a little bit shut it down okay whatever um it is 6:41, and i was supposed to be doing two hours two hours of school work i did like maybe like 50 minutes <laughs> my co-worker called me and i was on facetime with her chit chatting so, this is all I have <laughs> for <laughs> one part of a task that is, let's see, one, two, you would. Hold on, y'all. You see my son back there? One part of a task that is one, two, three, four, five, four, like four tasks long, right? Okay, so I had one of those moments where I felt stupid. I don't know if y'all ever had those moments, but I had one of those moments where I felt like completely dumb, stupid. I don't know what it was. I just didn't feel like I knew anything about anything at this point. And life had me questioning. <laughs> really? BJ, stop. It's fun. Stop. Why are you eating it like that, though? life had me questioning if i really deserve to be in grad school um so something that should have took me like maybe like 15 minutes to do realistically like pick out my elements and all that stuff took me probably about 35. um once i figured out what exactly it was that they were asking for it's been pretty simple but like i said a co-worker called me and then i started talking and then one thing led to another and schoolwork didn't get done so it's 6 43. I probably should start dinner, but seeing as we're probably gonna eat late, I mean, we're not going to sleep anytime soon. That's not really such an issue. So, trying to stay focused, stay the focus thing. So, I am going to complete task B before I make dinner. So, I'm giving myself until 7.30 to do task B. Then, um, Then I'll do task C and D at some point tonight too. My goal is to type this paper up and submit it tonight before I go to bed. At any given point, who knows what time I'm going to bed. Um, but just to type it up and submit it before I go to bed. Um, depending on how I feel later. No, will depend on... if I do anything else for YouTube today. I really need to sit down and go through 
hashtag spray out hashtags for all of my channels so I have them in a place so I know which hashtags I want to use or I can use at any given point. I want to do that. I need to make a list of things that I need to do, but you know, here we are. Um, I'm going to do filming for the hat tomorrow morning when I get up. That's my thing to do in the morning. That's going to be my YouTube thing. Um, so I'm going to make sure this other battery is charged. Um, so I can do that. I'm trying to think what else. Um, like I said, I'll go back and forth because I like to take like mini breaks when it comes to schoolwork. I can't focus on school stuff for too long or my mind just goes blank. So, yeah. So this is my plan. Task one needs to be submitted tonight before I go to bed. Um, and that's what I have to like, I really have to tell myself like these type of things like do, do the damn work. Do the work, Jessica. Do the work. Um, so yeah, I'm going to get started on that. My son is next to me. Literally, this has been my setup all day. I've been in my living room all day since eight o'clock this morning and now it's 6.45. All right, so I'm gonna go do some work. I'll be back. Mm -hmm.